Honestly, I already know. We are all tired of all YouTubers starting their videos the same. So me, I'm just gonna shut up and just, just let it ride. Greetings, loved ones. Let's take a journey. Thank you, Uncle Snoop. I really hope that all of you are having a great day. As you already know, because you clicked on this video, you wanna learn how to achieve these sticky nails in a way that doesn't look like, hi, my name is Ryan, I'm wearing sticky nails. How are you? And what's your name? Without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this video. Oh my gosh, I did the same thing that all YouTubers do. Um, let's just do this. Maximum effort. Hear the music. All right, you guys, to start, you want to use a nail drill or a nail file so you can buff your nails. That way it will stick to the glue much better than your nails not being buffed down because you will have a lot of shine on your nails and that will not promote it at all. So I'm just gonna remove my gel polish and now that I've done that, my nails are now buffed as well, which is great. So next you want to push your cuticles back this way you will expose new nail growth and this is the secret to making it look more legit making it look more like it's your nails because you are pushing your cuticles back and you're placing your nail within your cuticle Next, you want to cut the dead skin. You want to cut all of it so it looks much natural. You don't want any hanging off, any getting on the glue because that can end up causing lifting and you do not need any of that whatsoever. Once you finish that, you want to go ahead and clip your nails all around. This is very optional. You don't have to cut your nails down. I just like to do that just because to have a clean fresh start and whatever. You do what you want, you know what I mean? I'm going to go ahead and just buff my nails one more time where the nail growth is, where I push the cuticle back to make sure that there's no shine anywhere to cause lifting. Now that I have my nails, I'm gonna go ahead and open it. This time, I have to take my time very much so that I can make sure everything fits perfectly. This takes a minute, and I literally like to put them in rows and to make sure I number them correctly, put match them together. There's a number at the tip of the nail. Just so you guys know, if you don't know, which most people do know. I also have the brush on nail glue, or you can use the nail glue that it comes with, but I prefer the brush on nails because it's like applying nail polish, but it is much easier, a much cleaner finish than using the glue that the nails come with. Now I'm literally gonna take my time and apply all of these nails. Whenever you put the glue on, you wanna put a thin layer, not too thin, but not too thick. Like in between, not really a thin layer. I'm sorry, you guys, like I don't know how to explain it. You don't wanna put too much glue because it's gonna start to goo out and you don't wanna put too little because you're not gonna have enough for it to stick on long enough for your full two weeks.
well that's it easy simple i hope you guys enjoy your nice nails and let me know if this tactic works because it always works for me i be having my nails stuck on for days and i'm loving it so thank you so much for watching and please do not forget to like and subscribe if you do like me and if you don't and you guys have a beautiful blessed day because why come on you know you guys are all beautiful people